I, I think it's, it's very important, and I think the, the master plan pulled it off very well that, that we ended up with a, an addition that complements the, the architecture of, of our current facility. You know, this is such an iconic building here in, in Knoxville and in the landscape of, of Knoxville that, uh, you know, it, it had to do it justice and it had to be, be done properly and, and in a very sensitive way. And I think I think the master plan has done that. Um, you know, I think they, they were very sensitive to the existing uh, architecture and the forms of the building. I think inciting the new addition, I think they pay particular attention to how uh, the building will look when it's completed. Mm -hmm. Uh, and, and not ruin the, the, the predominant view uh, of the tower and, and of the church, particularly from Henry Street. There's no question that this is a special building in our community. Uh, but even in a broader sense, it, it, as I understand it, in 1940, President uh, 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 Roosevelt was driving through Knoxville on his way to the Smokies. And he was uh, recorded to say, this is the most beautiful church I have ever seen. And I think we all believe that, but not only that, but I think the, this is a very special building. And uh, as, as David mentioned, the, the John Russell Pope uh, design for this building, I think the architects that assisted us with the master plan said, look, uh, this, is a, this is a major addition. It's attached to the original part of the church. Hopefully we can uh, prepare a design that looks as if John Russell Pope actually designed it himself. It will follow the same uh, lines of the, uh, the Gothic uh, uh, revival style. It will use the same materials, the crab orchard sandstone and the slate roofs. We might even get some stained glass into this edition. But the, the north edition, which is the welcome center, which is something our church has needed uh, forever probably, is a, uh, is a grand place for everybody uh, to arrive and to uh, offer hospitality and fellowship and just a place to start before you uh, go to your classrooms or your worship and, and it's going to be a wonderful addition I think.